All right, you guys, today I'm going to be showing you on how to uh, take an old document, usually between 1997 to 2003. Um, there was just, just old extension DOC, and now it's D DOCX, which is the latest uh, Word document. Um, so you can see these two documents here are, you can see they're kind of have like that old icon compared to this one. These are actually in the old format. So if you see that icon, most of the time it's going to be because that's the DOC. Uh, 1997 to 2003 Word document. So that's from like old versions of Word. Um, so I might send you and you can open it at um, anything newer than 2003. So you don't have to worry about compatibility issues. Um, but I'm going to show you today on how to take an old document, convert it to the new format, and it'll change that icon. So first thing you want to do is open up Fire Explorer, go to View and checkbox the file name extensions. This will help you um, identify old documents and new documents. So now that I have that checked, you can see the DOC and then the DOCX. Um, so go ahead and open up DOC. And there's two ways to do this. Uh, the first way is just gonna open up the document, go to file, and simply hit the convert button. Uh, what this will do is convert that document and convert it to the latest version and actually replace it. So it's going to delete the old version and that's what this warning message is telling you. So hit OK. And you can see, and then we're going to hit close out. Hit save. And now you can see that first document is gone and we have a new document with the new icon and it's the DOCX. Second way is to when you open up the document, go to File, Save As, we just save it to our desktop, and here you can see Save Type. So you go to Save Type and you just select Word Document, and you can see the extension is now DOCX. Hit Save. That's fine. Hit OK. Go ahead and close out, and you can see our DOCX. So you can see um, the original is still there because basically what we did was we opened up that document, did a file save as, or of course that's going to create a new document and then keep the old document there. So that's why sometimes just opening the document, converting, deletes the old file, replaces it with the new one is a better option. So you can just save the headache of having old documents laying around still um, because you probably want to just you know delete them once you convert them. Uh, but that's it. Um, it's very simple. Um, there's a two ways to do it. And like I said, it's just because if someone sends you this file or if you have this file, it's just you're using an older version of Word. And time to get updated because you're in 2020 now. And if you're on Word 2003, um, not good. Uh, so go ahead and update and that's it.